Trevor Rose make Irish football history on Thursday when they play Spurs at White Hart Lane. They become the first Irish club side to play in a away match in a European competition at the group stage. Now it won't be easy for Michael on the Eagle side against Spurs, even if Harry Redknapp does not play his first choice side. There is such an abundance of talent at White Hart Lane that Spurs, who went into their last game away to PAOK in Greece and played four or five reserve team players, they drew there. That shows the amount of strength they have in depth. However, Redknapp is still set to play Albachenko, Korolyko and Bas Basson, and that gives an idea of what Rovers are up against. Now the odds, not surprisingly, favour Spurs, they're 8-1 to one on. You'll get 12-1 to one on Sherwood Rovers to cause one of the biggest upsets in European football of recent times. But don't rule out a draw. Uh, we've seen in the last few years that Rovers have gone to Copenhagen and only lost 1-0, they went to Juventus and only lost by the same scoreline. And remember, to get to this phase of the Europa League, they went to Partizan Belgrade last month and won 2-1. Any English club going there and winning by the same scoreline would have been heralded as a great result. That shows what Michael O'Neill's side is capable of. Now on Thursday, expect Rovers to play very tight in midfield. They'll play only one striker up front. They'll have Scott, uh, Gary Twig playing up there. They'll crowd midfield and hope to take on Spurs there and frustrate them. Now the, the big problem for Rovers in some of their European games in the past two years is the fact that they've let, let in early goals. That was the problem a few weeks ago when Ruben Kazan won 3-0 in Tala. Unfortunately that night, Rovers were a goal down only after a few minutes and from there on they're on the, on the back foot. Later in the match however, Rovers did create several chances and Ronan Finn had a really good opportunity to score a far post header. I think Spurs, who are not the greatest at the back, are vulnerable to possibly to set pieces and to raids on the break. So I think Rovers could score at White Hart Lane. The odds still favour Spurs to win this match, but maybe a flutter on a narrow win for Spurs or even a draw for Shamrock Rovers should not be sneezed at.